Hi, in this video, we're going to be looking at this little kit that I purchased on Amazon. This is an Expo kit. It comes with the whiteboard cleaner, an Expo eraser, and four markers, and they're all different colors. I think this is a pretty good set, and that's why I bought it. I'm pretty excited about it. Let's go ahead and open this up and try it out. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up and check it out. So this is the Expo dry erase set. So uh, first let me tell you why I bought this. I, I bought a new whiteboard on Amazon and it's supposed to come tomorrow, I don't have it yet. So what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna test it on my old whiteboard. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and test it. So you get four markers, an eraser, and then you get this stuff. This stuff is really useful by the way. I mean this works, but like it's always nice to have this. After heavy use, I usually clean it with some type of whiteboard cleaner, so it's good. All right, let's open it up. I have a lot of experience with um, Expo markers. You know, I've used these before. So it, it'll be nice to test a new eraser though. That's, that's really what I'm kind of looking forward to here um, because usually I don't have a new eraser, right? I have plenty of markers, but erasers, you know, you tend to use them for a while. You see how this looks? You see that? It's really soft and see the color? After you use this for a long time, it's not gonna look that way. It's gonna change color. Expo, so you've got four markers, an eraser, and then we have our wonderful spray here. Okay, very good, very nice. All right, so um, the spray is pretty good too. I wish I had a paper towel here. Maybe I'll run and grab one really quick. But let's go ahead and start by testing the markers. So let's go ahead and do that here, okay. So let's start with black. So nice, so nice. That's black. Let's do blue. Pretty nice. Notice the blue is not as smooth as the black. I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but the black is always better uh, when it comes to Expo markers, in my opinion. Same thing with the green. You see how there's like, it's not as solid as the black. I think it just, they've really perfected the black. And I think, I think there's still work to be done with the other colors on the markers. I think there's something in, there's something that can be better about them. So I do enjoy different colors, but I, time and time again, I tend to use black uh, when I'm teaching because I feel like it displays a little bit more clearly. Let me just show you up close what I mean by that. I'm just gonna turn it upside down. And you see how, uh, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but the black creates a more solid line. And maybe it's just me splitting hairs as they say, but uh, I'm pretty picky about markers because there's something that I use so much. So I think the black Expo markers are far superior um, to the other colors. So it was kind of a fun you know, motivator for buying this, the fact it came with different colors. So, you know, cause it's fun. I, usually, I don't usually buy different colors. So it is kind of fun. And let's just t test the eraser. Just, I mean, just amazing, right? Look at that, works fantastic. It's gonna give it a really good close look. Yeah, I don't see any smearing and you see, it's still not dirty. So after a long period of time, like if you use this to teach multiple whiteboards, multiple, like if you're using this in a professional setting where you're teaching for hours and racing with these, this will eventually turn black. Okay, so so yeah, very, very nice markers. Um, again, I use these in, in a professional setting, you know, to teach in, um, you know, I've used these to teach in college classrooms and black is, in my opinion, um, the best out of all the markers here. Let me just go grab um, uh, a paper towel really quick. Hopefully you can still hear me. I'm gonna go to the other room here, talking through the walls. And yeah, I've got some paper towels. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna test the, um, the whiteboard cleaner. I don't like to use the marker on the whiteboard cleaner. I don't wanna get the, the I don't like to use the eraser in the whiteboard cleaner. I don't wanna get it wet, so, so let's just do there, and then this, and then I just take a paper towel. So I usually use a paper towel, that's my recommendation uh, when you're using the cleaner. Um, also my recommendation for using the cleaner is to not use it like I did it. What I would do, this is just my advice, is um, you, know, you, you continue to use this, and when your board starts to have like marks, like when you're done working with the board, and or, or before you start, if there's any smear marks that the eraser won't get off, use this and then use just like a paper towel like this one 
and then you clean your board. So that's my advice for anyone who's working with whiteboards. So again, in my opinion, um, this is the best color right here. Um, they're all good. Again, I'm just being really picky. I have years of experience working with Expo markers. This, uh, personally, I use paper towels. Um, I don't use this and this together. It's just me. And what else? Oh, I don't generally use this um, to clean the board right away. Usually I use the marker first and then uh, if I want a really clean fresh start, I'll take some paper towels and I'll take this. So phenomenal value here, right? You get four markers, you get to try the different colors. Some people really like the color markers. Um, you get a little bottle of cleaner and you get uh, an eraser. So definitely, I think, uh, a fantastic deal. I'm very happy with my purchase and I'm looking forward to getting my other whiteboard from Amazon tomorrow. I got a really big whiteboard. Um, I'll, I'll, make a, I'll try to make a video on it. I'm really excited about my new board and I get to use these on my new board. I hope this has been helpful. Have a great day. Bye-bye.